Graph each function. The graph of y equals the square root of x is provided as a reference. In part a, draw the graph of f of x equals the square root of x minus 3 plus 2. There is a horizontal translation of 3 units right. There is also a vertical translation of 2 units up. Move the graph 3 units right and 2 units up to get the graph of f of x equals the square root of x minus 3 plus 2. In part b, draw the graph of f of x equals 2 times the square root of x plus 4. There is a vertical stretch by a scale factor of 2. There is also a horizontal translation of 4 units left. Double the height of the graph and move it 4 units left. Note that stretches and reflections must be performed before translations. In part c, draw the graph of f of x equals the negative square root of x minus 3. There is a reflection about the x-axis. And there is a vertical translation 3 units down. Reflect the graph across the x-axis and move it 3 units down. Note that stretches and reflections must be performed before translations. In part d, draw the graph of f of x equals the square root of negative 2x minus 4. Before we can graph this radical function, we need to make sure the binomial within the radical sign is fully factored. Factor out negative 2 to get f of x equals the square root of negative 2 times x plus 2. The graph is horizontally stretched by a factor of one-half, reflected about the y-axis, and horizontally translated two units left.